current imports of roasted coffee into Uganda has grown by 500 percent over the past five years, further underscoring the task that the local economy has to deal with around value addition. And if a ton is 10,000, there you are. So that would be the, uh, might be the value maybe of a million dollars or, or also. To show that there is enough production here, if instead of uh, investing your, uh, your coffee processor in France where there are high taxes, you can have uh, the investments here. Henry Ngabirano, the outgoing managing director of the Uganda Coffee Development Authority, also says scaling up direct investments into the local processing and roasting of coffee is still at crossroads. To me, would be looking at the challenges that we have. We've talked about the weather, we have talked about inputs, we have talked about uh, uh, many players who probably are not aware of, of what each other is doing, galvanizing all this and make, make it uh, improve. I think. But Dr. Emmanuel Iriamulemi, the new managing director of the Uganda Coffee Development Authority, insists that improving the current stock of coffee fields should not be abandoned as it would support targeted output. We are going to rehabilitate the old coffee trees. If we add on the irrigation, if we add in the, the fertilizer, uh, the, the, the simulations are very clear. Uh, of course, there are assumptions, but I think we can hit the target. There is an ongoing move under the Operation Wealth Creation to provide millions of seedlings to farmers across the country, with critics warning that it needs refocusing. Reina Ojon, NTV Business.